This is a tutorial on how to create a backlog for work packages in Open Project. So before we can assign a backlog to a work package, we have to create a new backlog, or in this case it's called a version. So we create a version. We can name it either phase one, we can name it top priority, we can name it after the week of the deadline, we can enter a description, and then you select a date range. So for this example, we're going to have the range be the first week of June. And we want to make sure to share this with all the projects within the project hierarchy so that we can assign this version or this backlog to any project that falls under that umbrella. Once we do that, we hit create. And now we've got our first version, our first backlog, and this one is the phase one, and it's for the first week of June. So if you want to add a second backlog, a second version, do the same thing again. You can name it phase two, you can name it second priority, you can name it after the different timeline. So this example will have it be the second week of June. And again, we want to make sure to share with the project hierarchy so that we can use this version as needed hit save and now we've got our two versions, our two backlogs. Now we can go and assign these versions to a work package. So if you scroll down, you'll see under details either you have the version drop down and you can assign phase one or phase two. If we go back to the details in this example, since the deadline is June 30th, we can assign this version as phase two, since it's not as urgent a priority. And it's updated. And so now if you want to add the version view into your columns, you can go and add that version and it'll appear on your list.